Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. You'll have to excuse me, I'm a little bit hoarse because I'm a little bit sick, it's that time of year. So welcome to Bow and Arrow Tarot. Today is the first uh, of the daily pick a card readings. I'm going to try to keep up with these daily readings, <clears throat> even though I'm a bit ill. And we're going to get right into it. This is a pick a card daily tarot outlook for any sign, right? It uh, doesn't matter what star sign you are, what your natal chart is. This is a pick a card reading. So just pick your stack and that's going to be your forecast for today. All right. I'm going to get right into it. And let's get your animal spirits. So, let's pull out your three animal spirits for each stack. One for each stack, three total. And we are going to pull out two beautiful creatures, tarot cards for each stack. And finish off with a romance angel message for today. All right, so it's time for you to choose your stack. We're gonna go from left to right. So stack one, two, and three, whichever stack calls to you most is going to be your outlook for Monday, October 21st, all right? I'm gonna try to have these pick a card readings for each weekday. All right, guys, so we're gonna get right into stack number one now and then we will do stack two and then stack three. All right, guys, so your first card out, your animal spirit is the beautiful elephant, fire element. All right, uh, the destroyer of obstacles also associated with Ganesh. This is the animal spirit that's been coming up a lot for my weekly and monthly readings lately. And please do check me out on YouTube, Bow and Arrow Tarot on YouTube, and uh, you'll get all the weekly and monthly readings there. You have um, your two cards, tarot cards, and nine of pentacles, and the hanging one, otherwise known as the hanged man. And your message for the romance angels today is engagement. So your relationship is going, uh, is taking a bit of a higher level of commitment right now. It's ascending, so this is quite good. For those of you who are in a relationship, could be that today things begin to deepen a bit. But let me start with your animal spirit. Your um, elephant is beautiful once again. This is the bringer of wisdom and abundance, right? But the elephant is the great destroyer of obstacles, first and foremost. And so... The elephant, the energy that the elephant brings into your life is one of removing obstacles and sometimes maybe putting small obstacles in your way to nudge you down the correct path. Um, in any case, this is done for the purposes of you reaping the rewards for your hard work and also for you to bring in learning uh to bring in learning for you and understanding and wisdom, right? The wisdom that we learn from overcoming obstacles or uh, finding solutions to our problems. This is very good for you today. We have nine of pentacles and the hanging man. So for some of you, you're coming out of a period. Uh, first of all, let me get into nine of pentacles before I talk about the hangman. Nine of pentacles talks about rewards coming in, a lot of abundance. But also Nine of Pentacles oftentimes talks about rewards and abundance that come in at the uh, sacrifice of deeper connections, perhaps. Uh, sometimes rewards and abundance can also alienate us. Remember that the Nine is also associated with the Hermit card. 
And so in all of the nines of the suits, we do have an inherent essence of being alone, perhaps not having that deeper connection with someone else. And so although rewards are coming in, uh, some of you have also a hanging man. So right now you're kind of waking up. The hanged one, the hanging one, or the hanged man comes in at a time when we realize we're waking up to a period of stagnation, perhaps uh, a period of really not putting your best foot forward or settling for less, right? And so this can be interpreted in a couple of ways. For some of you, today will be a day where rewards are beginning to come in after a period of stagnation where rewards have not been coming in for you. And for some of you, where the rewards have been coming in, today is the day where you're going to wake up uh, to, the, to the fact that you want a deeper connection with your lover or with a love relationship. You have been working very hard in your abundance, but in the area of your relationships and your deeper connections, there has been a bit of not maybe stagnation or maybe just uh, not feeling as though it's worth working for. And now you're waking up to the idea that yes, it is indeed worth wor working for. Today it could be certainly with this engagement. You could be having a day with your relationships that really get you to feel like, you know, now is the time for me to put the same effort into my love life that I've been putting into my material life and that has been bringing in, that have been bring caused me to bring in so many great rewards. But now I wish to share them with someone. <coughs> Excuse me. And so this is a great day for some of you to wake up to a deeper level of engagement. And certainly if there have been obstacles in your way uh, to garnering a deeper relationship with someone or obstacles in your way to certain rewards or to coming out of the stagnated period this period of stagnation the energy of ganesh and the beautiful elephant will come in today to remove those obstacles all right guys so this is your stack one reading stack two we're going to get right into it now and of course stack two we have the beautiful gazelle another fire element so today we have so far two fire animal spirits. And we start with the Ace of Wands and the Magician. Beautiful, beautiful energy. And of course we have in the love, love um, in the area of romance and love relationships, the romance angel message of the day for you is to let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. With the gazelle, we have a heightened level of perception and awareness. The gazelle is a creature that is uh, beautiful in motion. There's a lot of grace and strength. Uh, but the one thing about the gazelle is that it is indeed one of these animals that is always aware, always watching out um, in, 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 uh, because of protection, right? I mean, the gazelle is like the potato chip of the savanna, basically, you know. It's one of those creatures that is hunted, and it's very vulnerable. And so gazelle energy lets you know that for some of you right now, you may be in a vulnerable state in some area of your life. You may be feeling vulnerable, maybe a little bit. And so today is a day of hyper-awareness and perception, paying attention, right, uh, to everything that's really going on around you in an effort to protect yourself. Ace of Wands comes in and a magician. So for some of you, you are starting a new venture or project and you have a great amount of enthusiasm. So today will be the day where you will be working on that and the magician comes in to show that this particular area or project that is very close to your heart will really be a beautiful platform for you to show off your talent and your skills, okay? Uh, the, the inner skills, the innate skills that you have, uh, the things that you're able to do that nobody else is able to do in such a way that you really do look like the magician able to really accomplish and manifest anything. This is going to be a great day for some of you to get work done, to begin on a project. And again, be careful. Gazelle talks about being very aware. And so if you are starting a new project or you're working with others on something that's very important to you, today is a day of really paying attention, listening, watching, learning, okay? Um, there is a sense of vulnerability somewhere, and so with the gazelle, there is a warning 
to uh to pay close attention to everything that's going on around you and at the same time we have in the romance area letting go of control issues so for some of you um in the area of your love life today may be the day for you to kind of just let things unfold naturally especially if recently you felt maybe out of control or as, as though things are kind of uh happening out of your control right uh, when things like when your life kind of goes like that, sometimes it's best to just let it go and um, trust that um, things will fall where they may. Things will work out the way they should. All right, guys. So this is your um, reading for stack two for today and your outlook. And let's go ahead to stack three now. We start off with the snake, which is earth energy, talking about great potential and creativity. And the two cards pulled, tarot cards pulled for you today is the star 17 and transformation 13, or otherwise known as the death card in the traditional deck. And your romance angel message for today is express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. All right, so let's get into the snake for you. Snake talks about uh, the potential that we all have for great uh, creativity, right? Um, and so right now we're talking about really tapping into that potential. It could be that events are happening that are making you draw on particular skills that you would normally not draw on, which are now opening up your eyes to the fact that you have a great potential of talent in some area or another. <coughs> Excuse me. For some of you, this is quite new, right? And this is going to be in a very practical way, um, in a very practical sense, uh, you're going to be seeing the opportunity for you to showcase your talent, or you may be simply becoming more aware of talents that you've already possessed for quite some time that you just haven't known that you've had. The snake talks about a high level of creativity, certainly. Talking about also actuating that per potential. So the potential has probably been there. This is where we see the coiled snake, that coiled uh, potential energy. But today, it's definitely going to be released in a very practical sense of the word. And again, it's going to be quite transformatory. And here we are. We have the, story and tra the star excuse me, in transformation. And so, yes, this is a time where things are happening in your life that are giving you a vehicle for change. Um, this awakening of your potential talents and skills or your create creative expression um, is really a dream, dream come true for some of you because with the star card, we talk about hopes and wishes, ambition, uh, manifesting our hopes and dreams. And so today is going to be a great day of eye-opening uh, excuse me, eye openers for yourself. It's going to be a good day for increasing your self-esteem and self-confidence in the area, um, in whichever creative area that you are finding yourself. And it's also going to be a day for you where things really change. You begin to understand that, uh, you, you know, you begin to see, uh, the inklings of a different life perhaps or a new way of doing things or perhaps a new side to yourself now that you're actually manifesting something you've always wanted to manifest which is um having a vehicle for your creative expression it's quite good it's almost like a dream come true for you and it's so for some of you today it's almost like the, the first day of the rest of your life okay and of course with the love Romance angel messages in the area of love and relationships today again is a great day to express your love because Once again today is a day where you are really tapping into your creative potential potential um, And you're tapping into a great deal of self-confidence and with self-confidence It is always good to take the opportunity when you're feeling good about yourself to also express that and certainly in relationships when you're feeling good about a relationship, you're feeling good about yourself and doubts begin to fall away, it really is the best time to take the opportunity to express your love to someone. Certainly if after a little while or sometime it's been very difficult for you to express your love due to the general pressures of life, um, everyday pressures, etc., etc. So today 
is a good day certainly for some of you who have resonated with this stack three um, uh, to go ahead and make that romantic gesture with someone all right guys I hope you enjoyed this daily pick a card tarot outlook and do come back tomorrow for the Tuesday October 22nd daily tarot outlook but for right now have a wonderful wonderful Monday everybody and don't forget to check me out on Instagram Twitter Facebook and YouTube. Bye-bye now.